Randall should be the one laying there, not your brother. I'm not leaving you behind. You start butchering their people, and our chances of making it out of here, any of us, go down to zero. They had some supplies just sitting out, and Norma caught me. I didn't think she was going to, but she, she, she let me go. Michonne, what is it? Hope you're not thinking about jumping. Because if you do, I'm gonna have to come in after you. Not looking forward to that. Water's gonna be an ice bath. Really, you come after me? You're one of us now. And I can't be the only brains around here. Whoa. Freezing my ass off. Yeah. Coffee will warm you up. Go on. You'll be glad you did. <coughs> God damn, Oak. You can't call it coffee when more than half's whiskey. Uh, you sound like my ex-wife. She was more of a rum girl. Despised a lot of them when I first got on board, but they grow on you. Like mold, they are. Nah, nah, sorry, that shit is now. We worry about you, you know. Before I joined up with Pete, my brother and I were cooped up in an old canning factory. Food for ages. A lot of fat and happy people. But then, a young girl got taken. We followed a trail. It wasn't hard with all the blood. Ended up cornering the people who took her in this warehouse. All ten of us went in. Only I came out. You did the right thing. And it got my brother killed. The right thing can kiss my ass. A few weeks later, I came across Pete, a ways up the coast. He saw that look on my face and he offered me a job. Didn't ask any questions. Didn't turn me away, just welcomed me in. Pete's a good goddamn egg in a rotten world. 
I don't always get Pete, but I'm glad people like him still exist. I'll drink to that. Well, I think Berto's little routine is winding down so we can finally play cards. Care to join us? It'd be nice to have you there. Besides, none of us can remember the rules. So, it'd be the most uh, unique game of Go Fish you've ever played. Yeah. Do me in. Sounds like a challenge. You might regret it when I win that machete of yours. to see him. I need to see that bastard's face. <laughs> oh God, he's dead. I should have stopped you. How could you do this? That man was tied up, defenseless. You're better than this. He got what he deserved. I knew I shouldn't have left you alone with him. I wanted this. I, I did, but seeing him now... I wish I'd been the one to do it. Sam. It was my dad. My family. I should have killed Randall myself. I didn't do it for you. I wanted to kill him. Well... As long as you got what you wanted, right? <sighs> Sam, calm down. My dad isn't even in the fucking ground yet, and you want me to calm down? I, I, I didn't mean... He ruined everything. He killed... <sighs> I know, I know. You don't know. Wait. You hear that? Answer me. Now. Michonne? You don't want to keep me waiting. What do you want? Oh, you're gonna want to hear this. You might be sitting pretty thinking you have the upper hand, but your luck has changed. Michelle and Sadiq. They got the rest of the crew too. Oak and Berto. Look, whatever this bitch asks, don't... Sadiq! Don't worry. They're all in good hands here. But them staying that way is up to you. So listen closely. I'm willing to trade my brother for your friends. But anything you do to Randall, I will do to them. Do you understand? <laughs> I'll see how badly you hurt him. Look, you don't owe me anything, but please, we have to get them back. That's my deal, Michonne. That goes both ways. Anything you do to my friends, I'll do to Randall. You better not touch him! We'll be there by sunrise. Be ready for us.
She's coming here for her brother. When she sees what we did to him. At least he can walk, right? If you can call that walking. Let's just hope she doesn't take it out on my guys. Norma wants her brother. It's not like there's another option here. The bag helps. A little. She's gonna want to see his face. Maybe we can stall her. And then what? Norma's not gonna leave us alone. She won't stop just because we gave her her brother back. Even if he was alive, we still burned all their shit. So we run. After you trade for your friends, we haul ass to the back gate and get the hell out of here. But she'd take the house. Let her have it. Wouldn't she expect us to run? So what? She knows where we are now. Hiding isn't an option. So let's just go. It might work. We just have to be quick. The minute your guys are inside, we're out of here. I can't fucking listen to this. What? We're not done here. Sam! Sam, what the hell are you doing? God damn it. Sam, stop. Maybe you're all ready to walk away, but I'm not just gonna leave him like this. We couldn't give my mom a real funeral. My dad and I had to bury her here. Just the two of us. He'd want to be with her. That's all I can give him. I understand. He should be buried with your mom. But we can't focus on that right now. We have to be ready to leave. I'm not going. What? Sam, you can't still be thinking My that... mom is here, Paige. Everything I have of her. And Greg, if you want to leave, go ahead, but I'm not coming with you. <laughs> I'm sorry. But I, I can't go. This house meant everything to my dad. It's all I have left. I know you don't want to, but leaving might be your only option. It isn't safe here anymore. I know, but I, I can't just give up. We can fight. We can defend this house. No matter what happens, thank you. I owe you my life. Sorry it took me so long to say it. I know it's stupid, but I have to finish this. I've got some weapons stashed in my room. Old duffel bag. Should look familiar. You should make sure everyone's armed before Norma gets here. I was just... wanted to know what it felt like. 
I, I wasn't gonna shoot it. Just... Careful. You don't want to shoot yourself. Empty. Can I help? I want to do something. Sure, go ahead. Those slide in there. Ground side forward. How could they just die like that? Greg and Dad. I thought we were safe here. What am I supposed to do? You have to be smart. That's how you survive. My dad was the smartest guy I knew. That didn't save him. <laughs> the guy who did it killed my dad. He's gotta, I mean, <laughs> the things he said. The way he was laughing about Dad. Randall is dead, James. I killed him. I heard you guys talking. There's more people coming. To the house. Sam's hurt. If... If she... They can't hurt her, too. You have to stop them. Sam needs you right now. Go. Help her. Here. I, I don't know if I'm ready, you know, to have one. Take this to your sister. Norma's on her way. Things could go wrong in a hurry. Wish it didn't always come to this. Hey, Sam. Hey. Thanks for before. I, uh, I couldn't have moved it myself. Something you need? Want a hand? No. Having something to do helps me not think about everything. Paige thinks we're not safe here. Now we need to move on. Bet she's trying to convince you to leave, too. She's wanted out of here for a while. I guess she's found her chance. I'm not leaving without you. I wouldn't blame you if you did. You're here to get your people back, and that's fine. None of this is your mess. It's just so much of this place is my dad. It's all of us. He worked his way up from nothing. Took a job cleaning houses, paid his way through law school. When he bought this house, it was it was proof that he'd made a better life for us. We grew up here. I Maybe I'm crazy, but I can't let that all be for nothing. He was so proud of what he built. This place kept us safe. We were happy here. I get it. The world tries to take everything you love. You have to hang on to what's important. I can't lose anything else. I should get back to work.
Is that... music? You doing okay in here? I bet that was scary before when I brought your sister in like that. But she's okay now. Nothing can hurt me in here. As long as I stay in my fortress, I'm safe. It keeps all the bad stuff out. I put pillows and blankets against the wall. Was this your dad's idea? Yeah. My dad makes sure I'm always safe. So nothing can happen to me. Ever. Especially not those things. I know what those monsters out there are. One to go. Grandma told me about them. It's what happens when someone eats another person. Oh? I hadn't heard that one before. Do they scare you too? They make lots of noise. Even at night. I'll tell you a secret. They scare me, too, sometimes. Really? But my dad's not scared of them. I've been waiting for him. Where is he? Why didn't he come get me yet? Where is my dad? He can't come right now. I want to wait here for my dad. Alex. I want my dad. I just I want my dad. I want Greg back. I want everything to go back to the way it was. <laughs> Daddy. I wish it could go back, too. I wish it all the time. When Greg, when he, did he become one of them? It, it, it's what happens, right? He did, didn't he? No. Your brother didn't become one of them. Greg is still Greg. Is that what's gonna happen to me? Am I gonna die and change into one too? <laughs> no. I'm going to protect you. Nothing out there will hurt you. <sighs> Thanks. Two and three checked in. Coming up on the road now. Hey, keep the chatter to a minimum. Our friends are listening. Thanks for letting me see your fortress. John, take care of our children and take care of yourself. I'm sorry. I know that doesn't help or explain anything, but it's true. I can't stand watching you and the kids suffer, knowing what's going to happen to me and what I'll become. Better to spare you that pain I love you more than anything. Sophie.
Here, Pete. Thanks. This is a mess. Can't believe how fucking stupid I was. I get so focused on finding people. I wasn't putting the crew first. I didn't insist on looking. If I didn't turn us around and lead us here, none of this would have happened. It wasn't stupid. You cared about finding your friends. There's nothing wrong with that. You think after all this time, after everything we've had to do to survive, people would want to help each other? But no. They're just guarding what's theirs and taking out whoever gets in their way. I don't know why I even bother trying to help anymore. It doesn't, it doesn't seem worth it. Maybe I was just fooling myself. I wanted to think there were people worth helping. And now we all have to pay the price for it. This isn't you, Pete. You help people. You helped me. Don't give up. I won't. We just... We have to get my crew back. Hopefully my boat is still in one piece. Shit. What the hell are we gonna do? What happens after we hand him over? If she takes that bag off, are we really prepared for that? We're gonna have to fight. I trust you. didn't hear you come in. Here. Were you able to talk some sense into her? Or do you still think digging a hole is a good use of Sam's time? I've never seen her like this. She's... She's not thinking. Sam wants to defend the house. She wants to fight. You're kidding. Norma's got more people, more guns. There's no way we'd win in that fight. I don't know why Sam thinks she can protect her brothers here. I'll be out of your hair soon enough. Never belonged here anyway, same as you. That's one thing we got in common. Squatters in other people's lives. But that's not why you're leaving. I mean, it's part of it. Call it self-preservation, but I've gotten pretty used to knowing when it's time to cut and run. Norma's gonna be here soon. If they're not ready, I won't stick around just to watch this fall apart. She's so stubborn, though. I just hope it doesn't get her killed this time. You can't leave James and Alex. They've lost enough today. I know. I know. I'm not trying to hurt them. The Fairbanks kept me safe, but... I don't know if I can do the same for them. Oh, Michonne. I'm uh, looking for Alex. Have you seen him? I want him to be there when I say a few words for Dad. He wasn't at Mom's funeral. He should be there for this. Alex asked about his father. I didn't know what to tell him. I'll, uh, I'll go talk to him. You'll find him in his fortress. I'll meet you outside.
Sam? You okay? Greg and Dad? I just... I don't really know what to say. Where am I supposed to start? I don't know. Just say what he meant to you. Yeah. Okay. I'll give you a moment. Hey, you okay? Michonne. Don't worry about me. I'm okay. Fair enough. You know I envy them a little. They've managed to hold on to something we all lost a long time ago. Something like normal. I don't know how to describe it. Feels like before. Just a little bit. Sound like an idiot, don't I? It may seem nice, but it won't keep them alive. They don't know how to survive out there. Hey, I decided to stay. For the kids. Don't get cocky. It had nothing to do with what you said. Uh-huh. Michelle? She's here! Huh. I thought we had more time. It's okay. It's gonna be okay. Sam! Just go upstairs with your brother, okay? I need you to hide until I come get you. What, what's gonna happen? Are you gonna hurt us? Y you'll stop them, right? Right? Just get upstairs. Stay out of sight and you'll be safe. Norma's not after you. Everything will be fine. Stay together, no matter what. We will. Okay. I can get a clear shot of the front gate from upstairs. I'll cover you. If I can. I hope it doesn't come to that. This is worst case scenario, right? Thank you. Don't thank me yet. Paige, if anything goes wrong, I need you to take care of James and Alex. Don't talk like that. Paige, please. Sam, you know I'll... Grab Randall and meet us outside. out there. You ready for this? Anything goes wrong out there, I got your back. Right. Just stay alert and be ready for anything. You don't know what Norma's planning. You got it. It's just me. What the hell is going on here? I had my people hang back a bit. I wanted to talk first. Just us. Clear the air a little. What's your game? No game. I just want to talk. I don't trust her. Okay, start talking. Hey, that is what I'm doing. I didn't come here to fight. Listen, Monroe is gone. Sunk down in the water like everything I built. You and I, we've each taken from the other. All I want now is my brother back. That's all. 
and I'll leave you be. You buying any of this? You'll get Randall after you hand over my friends. After everything you've done, you expect me to simply hand over your friends, just like that. Careful, Michonne. A show of good faith, then. Any minute now. Safe and sound, just like I said. Now, I want to see my brother. Why the hell are we standing here? We're all homeless because of her. Getty, stop! They should be dead! That is not what we are here for. Now be quiet! My brother. Now, I have given you what you wanted. I just want to see him. I want Pete's crew first. Then I'll give you Randall. I think I've been more than reasonable. <laughs> Show me Randall. Huh. Oak! Hey, put the gun down. I could shoot him and still have two more to spare. So you're gonna do what I've asked. Now! I came here willing to talk. But if you're gonna insist on being difficult... Don't hurt him, all right? You're not gonna shoot him. You may have more of my guys, but this piece of shit over here is all you've got. And there's still plenty I can do to hurt him. Randall isn't worth all this shit. Gabby? Listen to After me. everything they've done, you're still giving them more chances. We deserve retribution. Don't do this! Stop! No! No! Uh. Uh. Virgil! Everyone put your guns down! Uh. I knew we couldn't trust them! Don't! Stand down! Please, don't hurt him. If you're not gonna do anything, we have to. That's not your call. Please. They shot her! Uh, Gabby! Fuck! Fuck! Oh, run!
should have been there with you. But I wasn't. I wasn't, and you. Every day, I wish I could go back and change it. Michelle, it's Dominic. What's Where the happening? hell are you? Go pack your things, okay? We have to go. Where's mommy? We tried to wait. We're, we're, we're heading to Donna's. Dad! She'll be fine. Come on. No, she'll come look for us. We have to be here. Michelle, if you're still... Just stay safe, okay? They need you. I don't know what else to say. I'm just... I'm sorry. See you again. When? I don't know. Soon. Say goodbye, girls. Your mother has to leave. Please, Mama. Stay here. With us. She can't. Just let her go. Dominic, please. Give us a minute. Come on, Alex! What are you doing? <coughs> no. Girls, enough. Let her leave if that's what she wants. Michelle! No, no. Don't go. Colette. She can't stay. We can't stay here! It's too late. Girls, listen to me. I have to go. I just have to go. Michelle!
Sadiq's gonna take a boat down to what's left of Monroe. Salvage what we can. We can drop you off in Oceanside or maybe one of the other communities up north. It's good people. Thanks. And thank you for everything. I don't know if we would have made it out of there without you. You found my brothers. You took care of Norma. We owe you a lot. Promise me you'll learn from this. Remember what happened here. I will. It'll be harder out there, without Berto. Might lean on you a bit more. It's not gonna be the same without him. I got you covered, Pete. Don't worry. I know I can count on you. I wanted to ask. When we got separated, I heard you calling for your daughters. What happened in there? I tried to find you, but I couldn't. I had to get everyone out and... I could just hear you screaming. I saw my daughters. I got to talk to them. But that's not possible, right? For them to be there. I know. Maybe you'd better start thinking about, you know, what if this doesn't go away? Maybe it won't. But this time, when I saw them, I was able to walk away. Couldn't keep living in that moment with them anymore. I think it's time to stop running. Go back to your group, the people you left, your family, before you can't anymore. If I know anything, it's how goddamn impermanent things are these days. Before you know it, they'll be gone. You'll have lost your chance. I'll go back eventually. When I'm ready. Just don't take too long. Come on. 